This is the beginning of the LaBeouf experience. Are you excited? Yeah. Shia LaBeouf? Does that make you happy? He plays in holes! Yeah, that's you're so excited because he plays in holes, right? That's that's the movie. I hate that movie. Hey everybody, uh, Ryan from Monster Bully Kindles. Uh, how's it going? Uh, today is April 17th, 2020. It is about 2.30 in the morning. Um, let me tell you what's going on. So we got a phone call about four or five hours ago from a representative of Shia LaBeouf and Mia Goth. If you don't know who those are, those are uh, an actor and his wife, uh, an actress. Uh, Shia LaBeouf has been on many different movies, including the Transformers movies, um, even Steven's show, um, Holes, uh, and a bunch of internet memes. So they contacted us about four or five hours ago and said that they saw a puppy. They've been looking. Uh, they only want the best of the best, and uh, they, they found a puppy of ours that they wanted. Uh, but one of the questions that they have is, how did they get that puppy? They wanted that puppy right away. Uh, as you guys know, right now we're in the middle of a global pandemic. We have the coronavirus going on. And they thought this was a great time to add a puppy to their family and be able to spend some time uh, before they have to do all their normal traveling and acting and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, so we've worked it out. Um, at first, we were wondering how we were going to do it. Were we going to fly the puppy directly to them or were we going to drive the puppy? Now, we are in Portland, Oregon. They are located in L.A., so about a 15-hour drive or a two-hour flight. So, obviously, flying uh, seemed like the better way to go, but because of the coronavirus, uh, actually the better way to do it would be just to go ahead and drive it directly to them. So, uh, we're about ready to leave. Uh, we're gonna, <laughs> within about four or five hour time, we went from wondering what movie we were going to watch tonight with the family to, Hey, let's, uh, drive all the way down to LA for 15 hours and drop off a puppy to Shia LaBeouf and Mia Goss. So, um, we're gonna, uh, try to film as much of it as we can. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what to expect. Uh, I don't know where we're meeting or uh, what's going to go on, but uh, you guys, we decided to go ahead and document the thing. Uh, um, big up to uh, to Dre with uh, BGK Kennels. We told him what was going on. He says, man, you got to document it. You got to document it, show everybody they'd like to see it. So that's what we're going to try to do. This isn't something that I normally do, but uh, I'm going to try to give you guys kind of an inside peek and uh, hopefully he lets us film and uh, do some video uh, when he meets the puppy. So. Uh, with that said, uh, we're going to get on the road, and uh, we'll bring you guys along with us. See ya. And we're going to bring a little surprise to Shia. This is Morpheus. Real hard to see him right now in the light, but this boy is going to wow him, I think. Right on here, Sam's got him. That little boy right there. He is going to make an awesome pet for Shia LaBeouf and Mia Goth. And he'll off the balcony. Oh! Luckily for him. Driving down I-5 right now, going to see Shia LaBeouf. It is about uh, 10 o'clock in the morning, and uh, most everybody's asleep. And I uh, just got off the phone with my boy Dre from BGK Kettles. We're going to try to meet up since he's in L.A. County. Don't forget, we have the pandemic going on right now, so we got the uh, coronavirus. So if uh, him and I meet up, we're going to have to do it a unique way because both of us don't want to get each other sick. So, But uh, T-minus uh, about eight hours until we meet Shia LaBeouf and Mia Goth, and uh, we're excited. We'll uh, catch you soon. So what's going on here? He's eating Morpheus's food, and Morpheus is eating his food. So Morpheus doesn't want his food, but he wants Hazmat's food. Hazmat doesn't want his food, but he wants Morpheus's food. Well, that sounds about right. <laughs> what do you think, Morph? Got good stuff. Good stuff, good man. Dude. Why are you rebagging him? Because the bag broke. The bag broke? <laughs> oh, there they are. These are the worst roads I have ever ridden on in my life. Speed demon. Zoomies, I'm slow. Cadence says, so when do you do the speed limit? When you're stuck behind a car.
almost there. We're gonna see uh, Shia and Mia here in a moment and drop off their new puppy. We're gonna uh, we're gonna respect their privacy and not show their house. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> That's Morpheus. How old is Morpheus? He's uh, not even two. Whoa! Yeah. We've been calling this boy Hazmat. Is he awesome? Yeah. About 140 pounds. Oh, pure muscle. Man, I'm just building a kennel facility right now. I think we have. So we we keep it more exclusive. Okay. Like his his pups there, they go upwards of fifty thousand dollars. Sure, I know on his pups. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. I was I looking online. I didn't know nothing about this for real. <laughs> and then I started doing the deep dive. Yeah, yeah. No. No. Well, you're bored, man. You're stuck at home, right? Well, no. Also, we, me and her, been talking about it for years, man, about getting a dog, and then. You wound up with a smaller dog. I had an English bulldog that was my heart. Yeah. And then I always thought, oh man, I want a bigger dog than that. One of my best friends had a pit bull, and I remember his name was Moses, and I used to go over there and hang out with him. And I remember feeling a deep affinity. And then I told her about it, and we looked at the picture, and she got scared, you know? Oh, yeah. Well, they it, look mean. They in look England, scary. In, in England, I think they're even outlawed. Yeah, they're banned. Yeah. 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 So my girl, you know, so Mia hadn't seen none of them in cat food, where she's from. Yeah. Yeah, they look mean, they look aggressive, but they're not. They're super happy. His his favorite thing to do is just <laughs> hang out on the couch with us. You know? yeah. yeah, he's snuggly. Yeah, yep. mm -hmm. yeah, they're companion creatures. Yep, definitely. They're not, they're not uh, 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 working dogs. Yep, you're exactly right. Companion pet. That's yeah. When we show them, that's the category they put them in. They have show... Yeah, look at this dog. I mean, <laughs> look how beautiful. He's so cute. Look how beautiful. I'm nervous about. I want to get another dog for him to play with, but I'm nervous for the because the first year I, I sort of want to let this dog own the house, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then bring in another baby when this one's one year old. Yeah, sort of like where you certainly do that. Yeah, yeah. They if, they if hung you, out in the back of the car the whole time. They're a little bit older. Probably be smarter to do a female though. Yeah, we're definitely yeah. doing a female. Yeah. My my fear is though what you know I'm gonna be with this dog every day of his life, but what what. What about companionship in the middle of this COVID stuff, like trying to be around other dogs? Yeah. You know, yeah. take the dog to a park and yeah. Yeah, you can. Yeah. what do I do? I can't. Well, oh, and you, you don't want to take him to a park until he's had all of his shots anyways. Well, how, when do I have, can you walk so we gave you, Yeah, to? we gave you the paperwork in there and we wrote it all down for you. Okay, great. Um, obviously you got our, our cell phone number yeah, two. Yeah, on the back of it I wrote. Uh, we'll just keep in touch. His... Yeah, yeah. You're a G with this. You know yeah, all about you, this. Thank you. Okay. He's sweet, man. He's so cute. You guys want sodas or pizza or something? No, I'm good. <laughs> Come on, man. I know you guys want pizza. I got a whole pizza for you. Yeah, we just yep. ordered pizza. Let me get a pizza. Let me get some right. pizzas and sodas. I know this is right. We won't, we won't say no. To that no, one, okay, man. thank so good. Fine. And, and I put I put two cookies on top of something. <laughs> thank you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he wants to go. He wants to go. We one couch. We just moved here, so it's, it's sort of a. No, you're good. You're good. No, you're fine. Like, don't you have to run after him. Yeah. Oh, oh, he's gonna fit right in too. <laughs> you don't know what you mean. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's. Hi, Mom. Oh. You have a big paw, though? <laughs> big paw. You're gonna be a big boy. Yeah. You're a lucky. Lucky dog, dude. Right. You're a lucky dog. <laughs> and I'm going to give Shia the number two. Okay. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, he likes you. He loves you. How awesome is that? Aww. Aww. <laughs> Aww. That's so cute. Oh, wow. <laughs> You're going to have so much fun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mark, what are you doing? Wow. Didn't act like that with us. <laughs> <laughs> More. Mark was like, let me play. <laughs> what about me? Mark loves babies. Really? Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm -hmm. He plays with all the babies. Come on, Mark. Oh, man. Yeah. Wrapping around people. No wonder. 
And you guys are where in Portland? Portland, Oregon. All right. Yep. Maybe we'll do a road yep. trip someday and come up and see oh, everybody. Man, that'd be, that'd be great. Thug, that's a good idea. Thug, yeah, because how, sure. how long did it take you? About 12 hours? 15. 15. All right, me and we could do that in the stretch. And you know, Portland is fun as fuck. Yeah, I've always Portland's been awesome. there. Yeah, Portland's always awesome. wanted to visit. Hey, let's it's do that, super, man. It's super and then, chill. then you can see the buddies, you know? There's yeah, 16 of them, cool. you said? Yeah, uh, well, yeah, we'll probably have more by the time you come there. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're yeah. actually, we have a female at home that's getting ready to have puppies in the it worked, day. It worked, out, it worked out awesome. I'm sorry, I forgot her name. The woman that comes. Lalani. Lalani, yeah. She, uh, she told us about you guys, and, and uh, after talking to you on the phone, I thought, you know, Cause he was gonna go somewhere else, huh? So he was sold. He was actually pre-sold, and then the <laughs> the, the virus happened, and uh, they had to back out uh, wow, because man. of it. So you know, there's silver lining. Yeah. Yep. Maybe we'll do a family reunion in a year That'd or something. Cool. That'd be cool. <laughs> Every year we'll roll up there for fifty. Look at, come on, Mia. That's you just can't take that from me. You gotta do a family reunion, Mia. You gotta do a family reunion, Mia. Good boy. You gotta do family reunion. Yeah. All right, we'll come up and see you in a year then. Good boy. Yeah. Man, what a pleasure. We love it. We love it, man. We love it. Thank you. Pleasure. Pleasure. You. Pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you. Nice. Hey, pleasure. Pleasure. So we just got done uh, dropping off the puppy, Hazmat, to, uh, to Shia and Mia. And I'm going to be honest with you guys that are watching this. I couldn't be... I couldn't be more happy. Um, Shia is awesome. He's an awesome dude. I'm not just saying that because he's a celebrity. Mia was awesome as well. Um, but... Uh, my wife and I, we know a lot of celebrities. We have a background. We know a lot of athletes, uh, a lot of musicians. Um, and and you, can, you can tell when people are genuinely nice and when people are unfortunately fake. And Shia is not fake. I mean, he was an awesome, awesome dude. Uh, he came out of his house with open arms. Um, he gave us pizza and soda and cookies. Um, he took pictures with the family. I mean, it was just a, a great, awesome experience. He wanted to know more about the business and what we do. Uh, he took time to ask questions and, and listen to the answers that we gave him and uh, assured us that he'll stay in contact and that he wants, wants more dogs. So we're, we're super happy. He's family now. That's what we do over here at Monster Bully Kennels. Uh, we do whatever we can for our clients. And obviously, Shia LaBeouf is a little bit different of a client than, than the normal client. But uh, we were happy to drive 15 hours here. And now we got a trip back 15 hours to, to go back now. Um, the kids in the back here. Got some uh, very happy kids. We're very happy. Shia took pictures with every every <laughs> single one of them. Um, and he was just, just a cool dude, just so down to earth. And I, I couldn't be more happy. And, and we're pumped. We're pumped to see that the puppy went to an awesome home. He's going to be loved. Um, and and I just, I, I really, honestly, um, I'm sure Shia's not even going to see this ever. But if he does, thank you. You're awesome. Uh, I really, really genuinely appreciate it. The way that you showed love to not only myself but my family. Uh, you didn't have to do that, and uh, I thought it was really awesome, so thank you.